four video makers what we will be looking at in this video is a camera mount actually two camera mounts and just by looking at them you can't really tell the size can you well let's put my hand down here you see that the camera mount is quite small and my hand is actually quite big so let's take a look at how this compares size wise to a 14 and 3 quarter ounce can of cream style corn used to be 15 ounce cans but now they're 14 and 3 quarter ounce so we see that it's quite small and compared also to a 5 ounce can 5 ounce can of tuna which used to be 6 and a quarter ounces and so we see that that's the size of this camera mount which we will use to attach a camera to a vehicle a camcorder a video camera and this camera slightly larger this camera mount I should say is slightly larger we'll use these show you how they work you can see my reflection there and you also see some lines horizontal lines that's in the rear window so I can't shoot any video out of the rear window so what I do is I attach the suction cup camera mount onto the roof of the car here and I'll show you how that's done and I'll show you what I use it for all I do is place this right onto the roof of the vehicle and this little lever here on the side I'm going to push it down and nothing happened right there let me do this again I have to apply some pressure and hold the camera and do this so what I do is press the lever down and now that is solid it's mounted onto the car and I can use this universal uh, type screw here on top to mount the camera and drive down the street and videotape some traffic background for my green screen work and it looks like this when I'm done. I could put the mount on the side of the car around right the door and it is very very sturdy and this camera mount can be placed on a window like that this knob just tightens and loosens and I use a paper napkin there for uh, keeping the mount from damaging the window in any way and then the camera would be placed right up here and could be doing video of the passengers in the car or it could be pointed the other direction and you could get traffic going by that is a very fast and low cost way to do some green screen inside the car that's a roll of wrapping paper that happens to be a good green color on one side it's white on this side that's just taped on not really anything fancy there and when we look at it from this side we have a bit of a green screen effect so now I will place the camera on that mount and just sit in the driveway and make it look like I'm driving somewhere now we can see that I'm in the car and we don't see my face very well but the uh, idea you can see that if I used a light inside the car and lit myself up quite nicely we would have a green screen behind me and you notice that the windshield itself is not covered with green if I were doing a real video that I wanted to look like I'm driving down the highway I'd put some green uh, wrapping paper across the windshield here but this 
is the basic green screen look. Now, if I put in traffic in the background and make it look like I'm driving along, let me put my face up here forward where I get more light. Or back here, or turn around and look backwards while I'm driving down the street. Or look up, do whatever I want to do because I'm actually parked in the driveway. I'm not driving anywhere. So that's uh, how we can use green screen and some camera mounts.